Log in. Alright. I'm not going to do this because I'm already logged into the bot. But basically, it's going to give you a little prompt. Click it. It's going to take you to Epic Games. Just log in. Alright. Second thing I'm going to want y'all to do. Stay in the commands, right? Do slash set up. Do, this is after after you already logged in. Set up. Pick Stonewood or whichever. Right now, all I know is the Stonewood work. Enter that on. Wait for it to load up. All right, this part is crucial. I want y'all to go ahead and download this first. Because we're going to get this out of the way so you don't have to come back to it later. So go ahead and download that onto your computer. Okay, now for the second step, you're going to have to come down to a website called Fiddler. And you're going to have to download it. That's it. It's safe. This is what it's going to look like. Click that first, the first button. Come down. Scroll just a little bit. Hit Fiddler Classic. And then hit Try for Free. You're going to be greeted with this prompt right here. For how you're going to use it, select Gaming. Put your email in. Your country, email, your state, it's probably going to ask you for a state, accept it, and then download it. So I'm going to go ahead and do this real quick, but I'm going to fast forward it and blur out some stuff. Boom, as you can see, it's downloading the top right. Now, I'm going to go ahead and do a quick transition and open up my files so y'all can see what to do next. Back to that first download, this right here. Go ahead and right click on this. Show more options, rename. Just rename this anything you want. For me, I'm going to name it HL for home base lobbies, right? And then just enter on that. Click the Fiddler setup. Boom. Fiddler Classic. You're going to get a, a window, right? Then you should you should be greeted with this. Just if you want to read through that, go ahead. And then hit I agree. Install it to whatever you want to install it to. This is going to pop back up. We're just going to close this out because you don't need that. Then hit close. For the third step, click your search bar and we're going to open up Fiddler, but we're going into the file John, right? So if you download it, it's more than likely going to be right here in the recent, but if it's not, just look up Fiddler Classic. All right, you're going to right click on it. Open file location. That should take you to this right here. Right click on this. Show more options. I mean, not show more options. Hit properties. Now, come here and copy this. Hit OK. Come back to Fiddler Classic real quick. Show more options. Rename. Once again, just name it anything. I'm going to name it GHL. All right. Now, we can exit out of the file for now. What you just copied, come over back to your search bar and paste that in. And then open this, because this is really what you're going to need to change. Scroll down to where you see Fiddler. Okay, I did not mean to do it like that. Show more and rename this one. This is the only thing that you like have to rename. This is a must rename. If you don't rename it, you're going to be greeted with this prompt, and I'm going to put it on the screen. So every time you join, it's just going to keep on kicking you out. So this, this right here definitely changed us. Okay. Now we can just open it up from here. From here, most of my screen is going to be blurred out because somebody definitely got docs on us. But uh, follow everything I do to the T, right, dummy? Hit no. Boom. That's out of the way. Copy. Copy my tool spot. So top left corner, hit tools, hit options, and just follow and copy everything I got down. All right. Just make sure everything is checked on them four little tabs I didn't show you. Now hit OK. All right, we back. You're going to go ahead and click Auto Responder right here. Enable Rules and then click Unmax Request Pass Through. You're going to add a rule and just type exactly what I type. 
for this little https link address i'm gonna have that in the description so don't be like oh you didn't show me how to get that it's gonna be in the description dummy i'm gonna do a exact semicolon put that address that's in the description in there come down here scroll till you see font file go to where you downloaded that first thing right this open that up now hit save i normally hit save twice and with that you're done now you minimize it do not close it minimize it right so it should be in your test bar cool now we're gonna open up fortnite i'm gonna speed all this up because fortnite be od with the screen sometime So as y'all can see, I am in the glitch lobby, right? Boom. This is not my home base. This is just a random glitch lobby that got generated. So to see if this worked, walk around a little bit. It shouldn't take too long, like 15 seconds. It should, it should tell you if you did it wrong. You'll get kicked and you'll get that prompt that I was talking about in the beginning of the video. So once you're in here, you want to set a timer on your phone, on your Alexa or whatever for six minutes. So that's what I'm gonna go and do real quick. Computer. Computer. Set a timer for six minutes. Computer. Starting now. All right, so for this part, I'm gonna just fast forward it. You might hear people talking in the background. That's my Discord. Don't worry about it. Alright, I'm sure y'all can hear the little dumb alarm going off. Computer, stop. So, now you want to go back into the, the Discord server that I was telling y'all about earlier. And in the commands, do slash do, let it load. It should say activate it. Let me go ahead and do that real quick. Boom, y'all see that? Amen. Alright, now... Now you're good to invite your guys or whatever. And just have them, you know, start dropping whatever you want to do. I can see he dropped them. And while he dropping, I'm going to just go ahead and explain a couple of things real quick. So first being, how does dupe really work? It's like, I make the dupe lobby and it's like a flash freeze prey. So anyone that joins the lobby, whatever they have in their inventory is like captured. Then they come in here, they drop it. When they leave, they still have everything because it's still there. And you just have them keep leaving through banner, keep coming back. Yeah, man. Same rinse repeat. That's how you do. Problem is... Three people can be dropping stuff at the same time, yes, but it is not as strong as the Lockbot one. You can only have 13 inventories dropped or this little lobby will crash. Because this is not my home base. It's really not anyone's home base. It's just a random lobby. And yes, it will crash if you overdo it. So. you, I was supposed to drop the item and pick it back up. I did not do that. So if you don't do that, it might even crash. Like, double time, but it's alright. Like, it'll be alright. <laughs> I'm not really losing anything from doing this. I'm just showing y'all that it worked. I'm trying to think of any other questions y'all might have while I'm doing this, but, I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory. You just invite them. And, yeah. I still work in duplication glitch now. Don't get scammed. <laughs> Do not go and pay for this. Uh... If you do have any questions, right, I will be in my Discord server. I'll show you all that towards the end. I just got to show you this work. As you can see, this man is dropping the exact same stuff. Boom, now I'm going to fast forward it just a little bit. All right, now, last thing, 
this is something that you will need to know. How to stop this dupe lobby. Host has to leave dupe banner while leaving one friend in there. The friend will be promoted to host of the game, and that will stop the dupe. So then from there, you can join and pick the stuff up. That's that's all it is to it. So I'm going to go ahead and unmute on Discord real quick and let him know. So I can show y'all that, that that is how you do it. I need a... All right, once again, I'm host. I'm going to leave through party. I'm at the banner. What am I talking about? My man's vert was promoted. He is still in the game. I'm going to request to join. Boom. The stuff is still here. I can now pick this stuff up if I want it. So I will go and run through this and show you real quick. I can lead through banner again. Boom, as you can see, the stuff stay right. I still have it. Right. 